the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen, amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. Praise you Jesus. Praise you Jesus. My dear sisters and brothers in Christ Jesus. Today I would like to speak to you about the key with which we can open the heavens. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now let us ask our blessed Lord to give his holy spirit so that we may be able to use this key now please close your eyes open your heart try to open your mind oh holy spirit come holy spirit come holy spirit fill the hearts of thy faithful and kindle in them the fire of your love send forth your spirit and they shall be created and you shall renew the face of the earth Hallelujah 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 come holy spirit for up our hearts and lives let them be a living sacrifice oh have your way as we lay aside our own desire come holy spirit Cross our hearts with holy fire. Oh, have your way. This is your house, your home. We welcome you, Lord. We welcome you. This is your house. Yes, Lord. Your home. Come. We welcome you Come in. today. Thank you, Jesus. This is your house, your home. We welcome you, Lord. We welcome you. This is your house, Abba. your home. Jesus. We welcome Holy you today. your house your home we welcome you Praise you, Lord Jesus. Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. This is your house. Your We welcome you, Lord. We welcome you. This is your house, your home. We welcome you today. Thank you, Lord, for your love. Thank you for your presence. Thank you for giving us your spirit. Thank you Lord for teaching us your word. Thank you Lord for giving us the key with which we can open the heaven. With which we can open the heaven and see your face. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Lord Jesus. Thank you Lord Jesus.
Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Last year, Pope Francis watched a movie, it's a telefilm called The Heart of a Murderer. It's a telefilm from India. I think some of you might have heard of Sister Rani Maria, who was a missionary sister nun, originally from Kerala. She went to North India to preach the gospel of Jesus. And there was a man called Dara Singh who was very, very angry with her. One day while she was traveling in a bus, he also endured in the bus and he stabbed her and she was brutally killed. And this person was imprisoned. And Sister Rani Maria's sister, younger sister, her name is Selma, she visited Dara Singh. And she said to Dara Singh, Though you killed my sister, you are my brother. I forgive you in Jesus' name. And she said, When you come out of the prison, please come to Kerala. My parents want to give you their blessing. And my dear sisters and brothers, it happened. When he came out of the prison, he went to Kerala. And the parents of Sister Rani Maria, they laid their hands on him and they blessed him and they said, You are our son. We forgive you in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And a woman shot at this beautiful telefilm and Pope Francis watched this film and he wanted to uh, see Dara Singh. I think now the process is going on. My dear brothers and sisters, Sister Rani Maria opened the heavens for this Hindu fundamentalist who killed her. Now he believes in Jesus and he is working for Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. While Jesus was hanging on the cross, Jesus made this beautiful prayer. Father, they do not know what they are doing. Forgive them. Forgive them. Then what happened? The centurion, he saw the heavens opened. That's why he said, truly, this is the son of God. So he could recognize the son of God in the face of Jesus. Because Jesus opened the heavens for him. So the key to open the heavens is called forgiveness. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. My dear sisters and brothers, I got an opportunity to go to Rome and I visited the house of Saint Maria Goretti. A very simple house. When I visited there, I saw the photo of Alessandro the man who killed Maria. Maria was only, 20, only 12 years old. Her mom's name is Asunta. And she taught her about the Christian principles. Especially, Asunta taught her, Maria, I want you to see in holiness. So this was imprinted in her heart. So when Alexander came, and when he wanted to commit sin with Maria, she said, no, Alexander, no sin. I would like to die rather to commit a sin. And this cruel man, she stopped, he stopped her to death. And when she was in her deathbed, the priest came to her and asked, Maria, do you forgive Alexander? Then Maria said, Father, I forgive him. I not only forgive him, when I go to heaven, I will take him to heaven. And it happened. 
it happened after long years of his imprisonment he really came to know the love of jesus and when the pope declared maria a saint maria goretti besides asunda this man was sitting she he was crying and crying maria goretti opened the heaven for alexander praise the lord praise, praise the lord. lord the key is given to each one of us the key to open the heavens is given to each one of us it's our duty to use this key praise the lord praise, praise the, the lord in the old testament there is a person called joseph as you know joseph really went through lots of struggles and sufferings his brothers were very cruel they sold him for just 20 silver coins and he was a slave i saw this beautiful film on uh, uh, joseph so when ismail here bought joseph for 20 silver coin joseph was really crying he was crying but his cruel brothers they didn't mind him and as you know he went through lots of struggles in egypt but the bible always says a very beautiful thing the lord god was with him the lord god was with him and the lord really gave him supernatural gifts to interpret the dreams of pharaoh and he became the governor of that land and he got married the lord gave him two children and he gave the first born the name manasa and the second one ephraim so it's written in the book of genesis please uh, chapter take chapter 41 verses 51 and 52 it's very beautiful these two names are very very beautiful only when you have this experience of manasa you will be blessed if you want to really get blessings from god almighty you should have this experience of manasa joseph named the first born manasa for he said god has made me forget all my hardship and all my father's house please listen joseph says the lord has given me the grace that's why i could forget and forgive all my all the hardships i went through in my father's house it's not a, it is not my merit or my ability but the grace so when he received that grace what happened the lord gave him another child the second he named ephraim for god has made me fruitful in the land of my misfortune if you want to become fruitful you should forgive only if you have this manasa experience you will get this ephraim experience hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank you jesus praise you jesus praise you jesus in the life of stephen you know how he could see the heavens opened when we recite the creed we always say jesus christ sitting at the right hand of the father so though he was sitting at the right hand of the father a person who really forgives his enemies what happens jesus who is sitting there will stand up because because jesus is very proud of you jesus wants to give you a shake hand that's why he gets up book of acts chapter 7 verses 54 and 55 when they heard these things they became enraged and ground their teeth at stephen but filled with the holy spirit uh, filled with the holy spirit he gazed into heaven uh, he gazed into heaven and he saw the glory of god he saw the glory of god and jesus standing at the right hand of god yeah jesus standing at the right hand of god till that time jesus was sitting but when stephen forgave the enemies jesus stood up to receive him into heaven praise the lord praise the lord hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus thank you jesus praise you jesus praise you jesus saint paul in his letter to ephesians chapter 
verse 32, St. Paul speaks about this forgiveness. When we forgive, we have to do it from our heart. And be kind to one another. Uh, be kind to one another. Tender hearted. Tender hearted. Forgiving one another. Uh, forgiving one another. As God in Christ has forgiven yeah. you. St. Paul says, we have to be tender hearted. When we forgive, remember that the Lord Jesus Christ has forgiven our sins in, Christ, in, in God. So we have to forgive our enemies just as Christ Jesus forgiven. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When Jesus gives a beautiful parable in the Gospel of Matthew chapter 18, Jesus speaks a very important thing to us. Jesus says, so my heavenly father will also do to every one of you if you do not forgive your brother or sister from your heart. So forgiveness should come from our heart. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. A small instance from the life of St. Thomas More. As you know, I am working in England now. He's a very powerful saint from, from England, St. Thomas More. He was not a priest. He really, he wanted to become a priest, but when he joined the seminary, he recognized that his call is to, is to get married. So he got married and he became the chancellor of England. And he was a person who practiced what he preached. Not only he, he practiced what he preached, he practiced what he prayed. So whenever we pray the Lord's Prayer, the Our Father in Heaven, we pray, Lord, forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. One evening, Thomas Moore was do, uh, reciting this beautiful prayer. He was praying from his heart. So when he prayed, forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Suddenly the Holy Spirit reminded him an instance that happened the same day when he was in the office, he got angry. When he recited this prayer, the Holy Spirit reminded him to go and reconcile with him. Suddenly he stopped the prayer. He went to the house of his colleague. Then he said, sorry, I am really sorry. I hurt you, sorry. Then he came back. Then he continued the prayer. So we call Thomas More a saint Thomas More. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Now let us close our eyes. Let us thank the Lord for giving us the key to open the heaven. Many times we might have failed in using this key. The Lord has given us lots of opportunities to use the key. Lord, we ask you pardon. We ask you forgiveness. In our lives, many times, it's very, very difficult for us to forgive. Every day we pray the Lord's prayer, your prayer. But we are not able to put into practice, O oh Lord. Oh, we need your Holy Spirit. We need your Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Father, forgive them. They do not know what they do. Try to pray from your heart. Father, forgive them. They do not know how much they hurt me. Abba, Father. Abba. Father, forgive them. They do not know how sad I am today. Abba. Here I stand beneath your cross. Abba. Oh, Jesus, and I pray. Father, forgive them. Father, forgive them. Father, forgive them. Heavenly Father, we bring before you all those who have hurt us. Lord, give us the grace to forgive them. Give us the grace to forget them. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Father, forgive them. They do not know what they do. Father, Abba. Father, forgive them. 
they do not know how much they hurt me. Father, forgive them. They do not know how sad I am today. Here I stand beneath your cross. Above. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, and I pray. Father, forgive them. 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 Forgive them. Father, forgive them. Hallelujah. Jesus. Oh, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Amen. Amen. of the blessed sacrament Jesus is here he gives us an example that we also should make ourselves humble before others while he was hanging on the cross he forgave and Jesus opened the heaven and he has given that key to each one of us Lord many times we have failed in using this beautiful key to open the heaven for us and for others lord we have come here to give you glory and honor jesus we need the grace to use this key we need your grace without your grace we are a big zero lord but when you pour out your grace upon us we will be able to forgive and forget please open your heart, hearts before the lord let us praise him let's worship our heavenly father father we adore you jesus we adore you spirit we adore you worship you lord jesus thank you thank you lord jesus we adore you lay our lives before Jesus, we adore you. Sing together. Jesus, we adore you. Lay our lives before you. How we love you. Oh, Spirit, we adore you.
now please hold your hands together and ask the lord to give us the grace that we may forgive others jesus there are many times we failed in loving others sanctify us o lord give us a new heart a heart of flesh a heart filled with love holy spirit we need your fruit of forgiveness now let us ask the lord to sanctify us sanctify me sanctify me oh god oh god cleanse my cleanse body. my body mind and soul mind and soul purify me and make me whole lord i need a new heart Lord I need need a new anointing sanctify me Jesus sanctify me oh lord oh god cleanse my body my dead soul purify me and make me whole and now we receive his blessing lord bless us o lord and we in this lord give us your grace pour out your grace upon us lord pour out our grace we need the gift of forgiveness hallelujah 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 hallelujah